We're live at the Henry Vilas Zoo. We're going to introduce you to this guy and other new additions to the Arctic Passage. We'll be with you in a few minutes. Good afternoon. I'm John Stofflet. And I'm Lee Mills. Our big story at five. It is going to be a very exciting weekend at the Henry Vilas Zoo in Madison. The new animals in the Arctic Passage exhibit get to meet the public on Saturday. The $10 million project is the largest in the zoo's history. And NBC 15's Lindsay Branwald takes us on a tour of that exhibit before it opens. Lindsay? Yeah, John and Lee, uh, this exhibit is pretty big. It's almost two acres. I've been here all day and haven't even gotten to experience everything. Like this log tunnel, there's tons of these fun little things to do for the family. But of course, the most exciting part is the animals. And Dane County and uh, the Henry Vilas Zoo are thanking everyone who has contributed to the Arctic Passage and say that these animals are now a part of the community. So we wanted to introduce you to the new members of the family. A lot of people here, a lot of folks are excited. This is going to be like nothing they've ever seen at um, Henry Vilas Zoo. When everybody hears Arctic, of course, they think about polar bears. And here they are, twin brother and sister. You'll find brother Sakari swimming in the tank. He loves to swim and he likes to do the backstroke. You'll see him doing that the second he comes out. And sister Zuka rolling in the grass. So these guys have grass, they have sand, they have mulch, and then they have the wonderful swimming pool. And you can see all that from the Glacier Grill, an indoor restaurant restaurant and the window view is great. So you can sit down and eat a sandwich and watch the polar bears. It's the only restaurant in the United States to overlook polar bears, but they're not the only cubs in the Arctic Passage. Ash and Lexi are orphan grizzly bear twins. Our grizzly girls have a running stream and it gets stocked with live fish from time to time. Right now, Ash is fishing. There's two carp swimming in that pond. You will root for them to have a, have a good success in their fishing outing. And today, Ash did. There, she caught it. Our harbor seals, so they've moved from the center of the zoo to the beautiful new exhibit behind us. These guys have twice as much water to swim in, and they're excited to watch you just like you watch them. Seals like to see what we're doing, and so they might be watching you more than you're watching them. We know and hope many of you are heading to Broadfest this weekend, but if you wanted to stop by the Arctic Passage as well, the zoo has made it really easy. They're running shuttles between Broadfest and the zoo this weekend. That's from 10 a.m. to 5 p.m., both Saturday and Sunday. And again, this exhibit opens up on Saturday morning at 10 a.m. to the public. Reporting live from the Henry Vilas Zoo, Lindsay Branwall, NBC 15.